Of course, not everybody gets to go looking for love on reality TV, though. With online dating now, there is a growing opportunity to find a match. When I was a bachelor, I didn't just get by on charm. I had lots of friends rooting for me. Your friends know you best. Friends, very important in this process. Last year, former Dallas bachelor Sean Lowe co-founded a dating app that takes a whole different approach to online dating. It's called Vouch, and it allows friends to swipe for you and you for them. And it's just been named one of the top 10 DFW startups. And joining us to explain more about this is the new CEO of Vouch, Christiana Yebra. Uh, welcome to the show today, and uh, congratulations on the job. How important is it to have a female CEO of Vouch? Well, first, thank you. It was a, an incredible honor to be selected. I think the team, first, I have to, I have to commend them, honestly, mm -hmm. to recognize the power of the female voice. I think women, more often than not, are concerned about safety and authenticity on dating apps. Mm -hmm. And research shows that 50% of women have been harassed in some sort of way on a dating app. So to have a female voice leading the product development, marketing, it seems like the perfect fit. A lot of women too are trying to escape this whole you know, hookup culture that you find with a yeah. lot of online dating and, and apps and so forth. How does this get around that? Because the, the whole idea of vouch is that you've got people vouching for people who are on there. Yeah. So Vouch is a social matchmaking and dating app. The idea is that people are on there for serious relationships, not for the hookup, hang out one time and ever again. This is for people who want to be on there for the, the right reasons. And by including your friends and family, who would ultimately meet these people in the long run, we'd hope, uh, it provides that accountability and seriousness. So people are on there to swipe with intent. We're not interested in the hookup culture. There are plenty of apps for that. Vouch is not that. So uh, how does this work for somebody who hasn't been on there? Uh, basically, you have a, a whole community of people who you really know yeah. Uh, who are saying, hey, why don't you go out with this one? These are the ones that we've picked for you, because basically that's just what pops up at the top of your feed there. Right. Uh, the people who, the people around you think might be a good match for you. Yeah. Vouching for someone has two different uh, purposes. Vouching, you can leave vouch messages about who someone is. Think of a recommendation or a referral, a reference mm -hmm. uh, of who someone is. So when you're swiping through, you get to see who uh, who's vouching for a certain dater. And then your friends who are vouching for you can actually pre-select swipes for you and matches, and those mm -hmm. sit at the top of your pile. That way you swipe for less amount of time, and you're instead focusing on the people that your, your social support group and your friends think are the best fit for you. And as a dad of two daughters, I also like the part where your family can be uh, in the group too, kind of making some suggestions for who might be a good fit. Right, anybody can vouch for you. You invite them. So if it's your friends, your family, your co-anchor, or your dad, mm -hmm. you can have someone on there vouching for you and providing that support. How helpful is this instead of just going in uh, blindly or going in maybe kind of making the same mistakes that you make every time? Because we've all seen people, <laughs> and or maybe we've been that person, who you go, why aren't you figuring this out? You keep choosing the exact same kind of person and making the exact same kind of mistake and it right. ends exactly the same way. <laughs> yeah. Now you've got people from the outside who might know you better than you do Maybe, uh, yeah. and, and kind of making some suggestions on how you might want to proceed. Yeah, Vouch is, is, the goal is to provide social context and support. Dating can be really isolating and whether it's online or not, it's a lonely experience. It can be quite repetitive mm -hmm. and that way you're finding the same people or meeting up with the same people. So by including your friends and family as a social support system, we feel that it's going to lead to better matches and longer lasting relationships and with input from your friends. And let's say you find love this way, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, you're invited, to, you know, a lot of times you sort of, you know, fold your tent and go home on a lot of these sites once you find somebody. Yeah. In this case, you guys actually tell people stick around because yeah. you've got some good that you can do now for right. other people that you know. That's, that's kind of the fun part about it is if you find success, maybe you find a relationship, a marriage, you can graduate to a voucher. So you hmm. can kind of continue to engage on that platform invite your single friends because everyone has a single friend that they really want to support and, and vouch for. So whether you find success or you're off of dating apps altogether, you can actually participate in Vouch as a, as a voucher. All right, so we know that this is intimidating to a lot of people when we start talking about dating, online right. dating, in-person dating, whatever it may be. Uh, you guys have a mixer that's coming up. Tell us a yeah. little bit about that. So uh, Wednesday the 15th, we're hosting a save the date party. So Vouch is here to save the date. We want to bring <laughs> fun back to dating. So we're hosting an event at Happiest Hour on the 15th. We're inviting single people, married people, our supporters, our team um, to come out and, and enjoy the evening together. Weather's supposed to be good, I heard. So. Okay, that's nice. So we've taken care of that uh, in the weather department. Uh, thanks for being on with us.